In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create a turret in real-time landscaping. First, click on the Modeling tab, then select Cylinder, and create a cylinder in the size of the turret that you would like to create. Next, adjust the height as needed. I like to take the cylinder and copy it to make a duplicate and then paste in place. So we're going to go Control c Control shift v to paste in place. Now if you see, we have two of the same cylinder. I'm going to adjust the height, and we're going to basically be making the trim of the roof using the cylinder. So adjust the height of the cylinder, two to three inches, however thick you need the trim for your roof. Next, adjust the height, and then adjust the size just a little bit. Scale it up, and then we're going to bring it down. Now it's sitting on top. Now we're actually going to copy and paste in place this exact same trim piece. So Control C, Control Shift V to paste in place. Again, we have a duplicate, put it back, Control Z, go back and then adjust the height to fit the roof height. I'm gonna go five feet for now just to see. And then, this doesn't really look like a cone, but if we adjust the radius too and make it smaller, you can create a point. Finally, adjust the height of this to accommodate the thickness of the trim. So we're gonna go up two inches. And now we can just change the material. We're just going to make it the same as this house right here. Copy and paste. Trim color. Now to get windows and doors on 3D models, you can't just go to the building tab and add a door or add a window because this is not a house. So what I like to do is add a window to the house object. So I'm just going to add it to the house. Then we're going to go to modeling then convert to custom. This will lose all functionality of the window. Do make sure to adjust the width and the height of the window before converting it into a custom model. It's gonna make it a lot easier. We're gonna click yes. Now we can actually pull it free from the house and put it wherever we want. Copy, paste in place again. And there you go. That's how you can create a turret in real-time landscaping. Thanks for watching. For more information or tutorials, please go to our website at ideaspectrum.com.